so after I tested the Ford F-150 Aerodynamic last time, I got a lot of great feedback from you guys. Many of you ask if there's a difference between having a exposed truck bed versus using a truck bed cover. So I wanted to answer that by 3D printing my own truck bed cover. First, I started by measuring the size of my die cast truck using this tool. Oh, and comment down below if you know what this tool is called. Once I had the measurements, I could 3D model it and print it out. Then, I test the aerodynamics with the truck bed cover on and check this out. You can see the airflow is much more continuous from the roof of the truck all the way to the tailgate. But I notice there's a small area right behind the back window where the air is more steel. And that's interesting to see. Next, I decided to test the aerodynamics with a truck topper on because I love watching stealth camping videos from other YouTubers in their trucks. So I printed the topper and used a plastic sheet for the windows. And here's what happened. Surprisingly, even though the topper adds more volume to the truck, the airflow treats the whole truck like one piece. It's really smooth and not much turbulence, so I guess the truck bed topper actually helps the aerodynamics. And finally, here's a side-by-side -side comparison of all three truck bed configurations. You can see the differences clearly. And let me know if you notice something similar from your real-life driving experiences. I'd love to hear your thoughts.